A resigned USAF colonel, Colonel Ross Didrickson claims that the U.S. government attempted to explode an atomic weapon on the moon, yet extraterrestrials kept them from doing as such. In the 50s, a piece of Didrickson's duties included keeping up the stock of the atomic weapon reserve for the egg and going with security groups looking at the security of the weapons. Aggregate Evolution Reports to the extent the standard goes, it's open information that a declassified report by the Air Force Nuclear Weapons Center from June 1959 shows exactly how genuinely they considered the arrangement, called Project A-119. When all is said and done, they needed to examine the capacity of weapons in space, and in addition increase promote understanding into the space condition and the explosion of atomic gadgets inside it. To the extent the data underneath that most likely goes further into the black budget. It's fascinating how the world is so into TV programs like Stranger Things, which delineates the Department of Energy and their contribution with powerful animals and other odd actualities, yet so eager to disregard a high-positioning American colonel who held extremely delicate positions at the Department of Energy for quite a long time, when the majority of this atomic improvement was truly hot. He is the genuine article and it's fascinating to contemplate what he may truly know. I additionally found out about occurrences including atomic weapons, and among these episodes were several atomic weapons sent into space were demolished by the extraterrestrials. At the very end of the 70s and the mid-80s, we endeavored to put an atomic weapon on the moon and detonate it for logical estimations and different things, which was not adequate to the extraterrestrials. They wrecked the weapon before it got to the moon.